All right. Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms and data structures, basic JavaScript, use the parse int function. All right. So the uh, parse int function parses, the st parses a string and returns an integer. So here's an example. If we do const a parse int and then have the string 007 right here, uh, it's just going to give us the number 7. And let's uh, reiterate this. The above function converts the string 007 to the integer 7. If the first character in the string can't be converted to a number, uh, then it's going to return nan, which means not a number, if, in case you forgot. Uh, so now we're going to use parse int, the parse int uh, function, in the convert to integer function so that it converts the input string, str, into an integer and returns it. All right. So this one's pretty cut and dry. We're just going to say uh, return parse int. And then we'll have str in that. And let's just wrap this thing in parentheses right here. And let's say, uh, what are we going to say? Uh, console.log, like that. And you see we got 56 right there. Let's put, the, let's put a letter in there. Four, that's not a letter. Let's put a, never, a real letter. Man, not a number. And that's correct. So let's uh, run the test. Looks good. And submit it. All right, now we're on to use the parse int function with a radix, and we'll see you next time.